Hey guys, Ziff Gaming here, and right now I'm gonna show you another tutorial. Well, in a little bit, I'll show you another tutorial, but real quick, I just wanted to make a little announcement for this Saturday. So this upcoming Saturday at 12 p.m. U.S. Central Time, about 6 p.m. in the U.K., all other time zones, I don't really know. You're gonna have to figure that out yourself if you are interested. So I wanna be doing a recording session. So that means Murder Mystery, Sky Wars, Hide and Seek, any maps we can get and we can record on, I'd like to do that Saturday. Saturday, maybe even Sunday just because my weekends are very available and it's good to rack up recordings that way if I can do that I can upload for you guys during the week and we can keep this YouTube channel going because I do love recording for you guys and I think it is awesome when I get to connect to you guys through the comment section and on Twitter so if you are interested comment down below your uh, PSN we are on PlayStation 4 right now I've only got myself and some others I know some others are interested it's not confirmed but I know some people like Abo and maybe Death Machiner and Bass Pro. I know some people who are interested. If you are interested, comment down below. You must have a mic and you must be child friendly. So if you have a mic and you're child friendly, comment down below your PSN. Say, I want to join. I'd love to join or I'd love to play. Um, I have all the Skywars maps. I've got a lot of Skywars maps we can record, but if you have a murder mystery, hide and seek, even if you have another Skywars map, can't get enough Skywars, um, if you have that and you want to host it up, we can host maps for each other, we can record, and overall we can just have a fun time being a bunch of friends and just having a good time on Minecraft. So again, if you're interested, comment down below or reach out to me on Twitter and we can get this going. Again, that's going to be this Saturday, so tomorrow from... So it's going to be at 12 p.m. We're, I want to start, I want to get everybody in a party and maybe start around 12, 12 p.m. Well, I want to get people in the party before that. I'd like to start, you know, hosting up map, maybe get into recording around 12 p.m. U.S. Central Time, 6 p.m. U.K. If you're in another time zone and you're interested, just figure it out. Figure out what time zone it is. Or if you really don't know how to figure that out, reach out to me. Tell me your time zone, where you're at, and I'll figure it out for you. I have no problem doing that. So... That's gonna, yeah, that's the little announcement I wanted to do right there. So, you know, I'm just trying to get some recordings done, have some fun overall with all of you guys. So, again, comment down below or reach out to me, Twitter, if you're interested. But for now, we've got an awesome tutorial. This is probably one of my favorite tutorials so far. Um, uh, the shulker box storage is probably, this one goes neck to neck to be my favorite, but I do love this one. So, I want to show you guys this one real quick. So, as you can see, let's just say you have your house. Um, Believe me, I build better houses than this. This is just for, de for uh, demonstration purposes. But let's say you have your house, and anybody can get inside by pressing this button, of course. But what if you don't want anybody inside? How are you going to lock your door? Can you lock your door in Minecraft? Well, yes, you can. I'm going to show you that right now. If we go on to the other side, so this is the inside of your house. So it's up right now. Our lever is up, meaning the door is unlocked and anybody can come in. But if I put this lever down, the door should be locked. So let's test that. So I'm back outside. Can I go inside the house by pressing this button? No, I can't because now the door is locked. So me on the outside cannot come into your house because your door is locked. Now, if you want to let me in, you put it up. Oh, the door is unlocked and you can come in. So I think that's awesome, guys. I think that is so awesome that you can lock your door like that. And the redstone is so simple on it. Now, in, when you're inside, all you got to do is press this button. Anybody can get out no matter if the lever is up or down. So if it's down, you can still get out. If it's up, you can still get out. That doesn't matter. It's just a matter of fact of the person outside getting in if the door is locked or unlocked. So it's very easy to build. As you can see, this is all the redstone that is involved right here. So it's very little redstone for an awesome creation. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that right now. So I'm building it in the air just because to make it easier. Um, because if you have, if your house is on ground, of course, it's probably going to be underground. I mean, it's going to be on ground. You might need to go underground to build it. I'm not really sure. Sure, I haven't tried it. You might have to go a bit underground, not too much though, where it's going to be a problem. So, but all you need is a four by seven. So I'll show you that right now. And again, you don't have to have stone and brick. It can be made out of anything. So you're going to want to go four this way and seven back this way. Five, six, seven. So that's your platform. 
Right here, we're going to have our brick wall going like this. So this is the wall to our house. This is the outer wall. This is the wall on the back of this wall. It's where the redstone's going to go. And you can always cover that up. So this could actually, you know, maybe this part is like a hallway that's covered up. On the other side of this wall, there's a hallway that's in your house. It's whatever you want to do. It's up to you to figure out how you want to incorporate into your house. I'm just showing you how it works. So now we're going to go ahead and we're going to build our doorway right here. So where our doorway is going to go, I forgot to get the iron door. Here's the iron door. We're going to place our button here and our lever here. And just so you understand that this is, you know, this part is the inside. So we'll build a little roof. So this is the inside of the house. This is the outside. And here's the redstone. The redstone is very simple. All you're going to want to do is come under here. It doesn't matter what block you use again. I'm just using it to mark it like this. You're going to want to come under here like that. Two blocks like that. And then you're going to want to go across like this. Break your block right there. Go like this and go like this and go like that. That's all you're going to want to do. This part right here you're going to fill in. But for now you're going to need to get in there real quick. So the first thing you want to do is take your redstone torch. Place it on that block like that. Come in here. Place redstone torch on this block. Redstone dust back there. You can recover that up right there. And then you're going to want to go one, two, three. Redstone dust. So all you need if you're building this in survival, all you need really, redstone wise, is two redstone torches and five dusts of redstone. I forgot the redstone dust right there. Five dusts of redstone. That's all you need. So it's very simple to even build it in survival. And once you do that, you can always, like I said, Covering it up like this does not affect the redstone in any way. And I'll show that to you guys right here. I'm just going to cover it up right now. I'm going to cover up all the redstone just like this. Look, just covered up all the redstone. And here's how it works. Again, I'll show you. The door is unlocked right now. We can go inside. So the door is unlocked. Come inside. I don't want anybody to get in. Put the lever down. And the door is now locked. They cannot come inside. And again, if you need to remember, you can always put a sign right here and you can go. I'm not going to fully. I'm just going to put up, unlock. And you could put down, locked. Anything you need to remember, just put it like that. So you know, okay, if you want the person, the person's allowed to come in. Put this lever up. There you go. He can come in. Or... If you don't want anybody coming in, just put that lever down. The door is locked. This button no longer works with the door, and they can't come in from the outside. So, guys, I thought this th creation was amazing, so I wanted to bring it to you guys. I am not the discoverer of this creation. It's actually Mr. QB on YouTube, so his link's going to be in the description below. Go check him out. Give him a like, subscribe, whatever you want to do to show him some support for discovering this awesome creation and showing it to me through the power of YouTube to show to you guys so that you can see this and discover it. Like I, like I said, I think that th I, I think this creation is amazing to be able to lock your door. I just thought that's amazing. I never thought I could lock my door in Minecraft, but I thought that's amazing. So if you did too, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. Again, remember if you want to join Saturday, if you're interested, child friendly, have a mic, comment your PSN down below, or reach out to me Twitter, and we'll get that settled. And that's gonna be it, guys. Bye!